All right, I'm the Fly Raid Master, and today we're going to do a kind of update video and talk about a cool feature about the launch tools. Now, the launch X431, um, I'm going to be doing a video coming up on the scope of this tool, so get subscribed for that. The tool itself has been great. Uh, I've had one minor issue with it, and that's not unique to this tool for I don't know what it is about the Revel Hutches and our Wi-Fi, <laughs> but like my Bosch tool, nine times out of 10 will not hook to the internet in the hutch. I have to take it out of the hutch and resync it to the internet, but that that's just kind of a minor annoyance and probably a positioning thing with the Wi-Fi and the Wi-Fi adapter in this tool, I don't know, but get on with, <laughs> but anyway. So one of the cool features about this, if you pay for the service, is X431 Fix. Now what this is, it's a complete integration with a uh, the software package. What I mean by that is, let's say you scan a vehicle and you've got a check engine light. You've got a code, you push, when you go to enter that module, it'll go X431 Fix. You click on it, it'll go right to motor information and specifically the information on that code as well as TSBs, which that's very cool. Instead of having to go to a laptop or any of that kind of other stuff. Now, obviously you can also hook up, you know, to Identifix, all data, Mitchell and all that through the tool as well. It's a web, you know, it's a tablet, but it's integration is really cool because you go right to what you need. You know, the other day, uh, the other day I was making sure a Nissan was under the uh, PO101 reflash criteria. It was, <laughs> imagine that. And it took me right to the TSB, quick, easy. I was doing it in the parking lot. It's a really cool feature. Um, obviously more for a shop owner to pay for that than a technician but it's a great way to maximize your technician's time because literally it's one click away, page loads. It's already put that vehicle in motor and it's already pulled up that specific code so it can be real time saver when, you know, like I was, I was diagnosing cars in the parking lot. Two dead bays will do that. <laughs> kind of the weeks I've been having lately, but it's a really nice feature. Um, definitely something to look into if you've got one of these tools. I believe on all of their bigger tools, it is available. So you can, you know, get the service and you can just literally, it's one click away and you get right to the information you need, which is really cool because time's money in this business and well, if it saves you a little bit of time. That's always a good thing. Because I'd have had to walk my butt in here copy and paste the VIN number in, and then go to either Identifix or All Data and search up that code. And you know, All Data doesn't do, you know, like All Data, when you search a code, it might pick up a TSB, but probably not. So you go into the TSB, you know, page, go into the, you know, Google search bar, you know, looking for that code. Maybe it picks it up. Maybe they didn't title it that way and it doesn't come up in the search. So you got to go scroll through it. This instant. And you know, you got the information you need right there. So definitely a cool feature. Other than that, I have no complaints about this tool. It's done everything I've needed it to do. You know, it, it, it's, it's, it's a solid workhorse. So I hope you enjoyed this update. As always, thanks for watching. I am the Fly Raid Master.